Hello everyone. Today we are still going to discuss on how we are going to use Kubernetes uh, command prompt to find some specified string. In order to find the specified string of word, of course you need to specify the pathway of the selected folder or so. And in this case, I I need to change the directory. Okay, then I click enter. And before we type in any command in this uh, window command line, we go to look for this multiple file that I have created previously, for example. Then I open it one by one. Okay, you can see that actually uh, there are three different files that I created but they are each of them carrying the same information there are some article that I get it from online source uh, but just for example then I close it okay next uh, we go go back to the I mean, for example I want to find uh, the string of word let's say major then followed by uh, the file name uh, just type uh, report dot txt then I click enter okay based on the output uh, you can see the first line the show report dot txt this is the file name and that I look for just now means that it have some string match with the the sentences that I store in this report file now as you can see the output also display three sentences if you realize that but I do believe there are more than three sentences which contain major this may be due to cache sensitive so we have to add on one more parameter to remove the cache sensitivity we type file major we put a slash i to remove the cache sensitive then I click enter Okay, then we check the output again. Uh, you realize that they are actually have four sentences. They are contain the same string of word, but because of cache sensitive sensitivity that I mentioned earlier, the menu didn't realize actually they have one more sentence. And but although you can see the output now display four sentences, but there will be a problem when you need to display, I mean, more sentences let's say more than 10 sentences that could make you spend a lot of time to identify it therefore we can display the output in next slide with line number as well we put a slash n Now the system clearly display the line number in square bracket at the beginning of each sentences. In, but also in many cases, you may need to find a string of words which contain major from multiple file. Maybe it's not just the file that you specify just now. So in order to do that, we can use command like then we purposely leave it blank but just add on star sign in front of the file type remain the dot then you go back to see the output again the system will automatically separate 
the multiple file which containing the same string of work. But then based on this output, they are at, at least we know that three files containing the same string of work. Actually, there are commands which call find string also can perform the same way and providing even more functions. First of all, we begin with the easiest one. Let's say I would like to filter for string of word which is in additions. Let's say um, you can simply type in to filter out the word at the beginning of the sentences. We type in find string slash b slash i then the string of word let's say in additions I just put one word which is in and report txt the system display three lines of sentences containing the string of word which is in maybe in some time you forgot which file is containing the same string of word that you would like to look for in this case you are not necessary to point out the specified I mean the file file name but just straight forward filter from entire folder let's say I can simply type file string and but in this case I I don't look for major or in anymore I just type in few then I type in the pathway C drive then also I type in the star sign I put a dot, then start side again, then I click enter. Uh, based on the output, when you look at the first line, it show cannot open. But don't worry, you are not getting any error, because the system is scanned the folder, but not the documents or any file, so it will show cannot open. But this is making sense. So based on the output, you know that there are actually three files containing the the word which is field. The first one is report. Uh, the second one is report one. The third one is report two. If you want to filter the file name, if the file contains the same tree of word, I mean just to filter the file name. No need to see any contain inside the file so I just you file string slash i then you put a slash m then in this case I can also I use back the word which is major then I put a star sign dot pst then I click enter uh, based on the output you know that at least three files containing the same string of word uh, hopefully this video could at least give you some tip in finding some string from the file and also again I thank you for watching my video